Hola de España, I'm Jeanette and welcome to For the Love of Puzzles. Hi everyone, I'm Donna Louise and I'm so excited to still be in Madrid with Jeanette from Jeanette and Her Puzzles. We've just competed in four days, was it four, yeah, days? four days? It felt like four weeks. Four <laughs> days of speed puzzling competition at the World Jigsaw Puzzles Championships in Valladolid, which yes. is like one hour out of Madrid. One hour like north east? West. Uh, west. Know. Northwest. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we just recorded some stuff for Jeanette's channel. Yes. And that's did. over there. So you can go watch yeah. at the end. <laughs> go watch Jeanette's video. I'll leave a link in the description below. We were here, it's our last day together. Yeah, I know. Yeah. It's, it's so sad. We, yeah, it is. I'm really sad. We had so much fun. Yeah, we really did. Oh, so much fun. And so tomorrow we leave the hotel and we take the train and we go to the airport and yeah but no <laughs> it's no no, no. We're, gonna, we're not gonna start crying no now. crying no crying but we'll get to see each other again in like a year yeah yeah because we're coming back we got to come back definitely have to back. come back yeah like it's the best thing oh it, that happened like honestly it was so amazing yeah. everything everything was just amazing okay so to continue the conversation yes. from my video. Mm -hmm. So, what was your most mem memorable thing from the like? It can be competition, it can be outside competition, just like from the trip. Uh, well, there's a few bits. Like, obviously, like meeting you, Vicky and Juby, that goes without saying. Okay, and then you mentioned about the puzzle night, oh my God. which was the amazing. <laughs> so you can hear about that. But I just have to say also, meeting Alejandro. Yeah. The, the the champion, the world fastest, wasn't he like truly the nicest guy? Not that I didn't think he wouldn't be a nice guy, but he's so humble and friendly and nice and welcoming. Yeah. You know, he truly was, wasn't no, he? No, definitely. And then the main organizers of the event, Alfonso. Oh my gosh. And the nicest man. But is he just like Spanish man, man or is I it don't just know. <laughs> I don't know. Like they were so lovely and if you watch the live streams there was charlie right yeah. charlie did the english like like the, well, com, the, the english like intros and stuff yeah nicest guy so oh tall my God. so yeah. tall <laughs> they were so welcoming and yeah. so friendly not that i didn't think they were but it was like it was like we've known each other like it was like we were here last year and they were excited to see us again basically yeah ah so welcoming as well yeah, and the one everyone. thing like we didn't expect is all the kisses from oh, yeah. oh my god from Spanish people. <laughs> I just I whacked Alejandro's face, and I'm like, sorry, I'm not used to the kissing, and and yeah, no. And for me, also, what set the tone when we went to the opening ceremony. Yeah. So Jeanette's like, come on, let's go to the front, let's go to the front, because it was just in the dome, and the tables were all set up, and we were just standing or sitting and they did like it it was you know it didn't take that long the opening no was, i think it was more for like people to come there and maybe yeah. like you try to find your teammates or like yeah. your partners and stuff see people from last year yeah if you remember anyone so Jeanette's like let's go to the front so she kept walking up front and we stopped at a table and i looked and it was sarah from sarah does puzzles yeah she, sarah schuler and she turned around and saw me and i said hi sarah and she went oh my god hi and she gave me the biggest hug and i was like that set the tone for me like everyone's wow. just happy to be there everyone's having so much fun yeah definitely. everyone was so welcoming like right from the get-go i was like oh my god this is amazing you know yeah and yeah. then miss alma as well oh alma. this is the most adorable thing from the competition yeah like when i saw her i was definitely fanning of her I know you were like oh, I was like on day one we got pictures together yeah. I was just like I need a picture sorry guys and she I think she is like all about puzzles oh yeah all she about just puzzles. did not stop puzzle for mm -hmm. the entire time and I asked her I said are you nervous for the competition so just to clarify Alma eight years old on Instagram her mom runs her Instagram Alma Bell oh, puzzle whiz puzzle whiz we done the scores in between yeah yeah and um she what was i gonna say oh so she's too young to compete for individuals because it was yeah. it 16 the lowest age i think he had to be 16. 16 or 14. I'm no because the other yeah 16. Okay. 
16. So, but Alma was able to compete in pairs and on a team. So that's why she was there. And I said to her, cause I'm like kind of freaking out. I go, are you nervous? And she just went, no, I'm not nervous. And I was like, oh my God. Yeah. yeah. Well, we did find out that they have like two competitions a month in yes. Spain. Yes. So they're definitely more used to it than we are. Yeah. And I think but... they do junior categories. Yeah. They do like three levels of junior categories. Speed puzzling is huge in Spain. Very much I so. I didn't know they did two competitions a month. No, neither did I. Oh I found God. out on my final puzzle when I was chatting to a Spanish guy next to me. Yeah. I <laughs> so, mean, yeah. would you be able to do a competition? My heart can't handle this. Well, I I would assume that like you would kind of get used to maybe, it. Maybe. Yeah. Like, maybe not completely get... Like Alejandro said that he still gets nervous. Yeah. yeah. So it's not like you completely like ignore everything and yeah. be like oh i'm just puzzling i think you still feel like the pressure yeah to perform maybe even yeah i did say to him i said like you know i hope us meaning us the other competitors and stuff we don't we're not overwhelming you or putting pressure on you we're just all excited to to meet you yeah. and see you puzzle and you're amazing regardless and he's like yeah 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 no 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 like and he's like he's really good i think with remembering faces as well oh yeah because, like, we chatted to him once, mm -hmm. and the next day he was like, just, oh, you did so well. And I'm just like, oh, okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I, I will admit, oh, my goodness. And maybe, you know, jet lagged, tired, overwhelmed. I kept being like, Jeanette, I, I have this little book. I'll, I'll admit it, a little book. You have to show it. Okay. Oh, to, God. When you I'll, get home well, and you unpack. I'll take a picture. Yeah. And, um, um. The thing is, I'm just, it was a lot, like, it, yeah. you know, and I'm totally jet lagged, tired, 10 hours difference. It's now 11 hours difference. And I would say, okay, Jeanette, just, just sit down with me. Okay. From France, it was Laura. And is she on Instagram? And what's her Instagram? And so I have this list of people with country, their name and their Instagram or YouTube name, because yeah. sometimes different. it would be, people would be on YouTube and on Instagram, but they wouldn't have the same names. And that's not actually their real name. Like, yeah, like oh, Carolina yeah. from Ukraine is yeah. Yeah, so there was a little bit of complications because, for instance, Donna Louise is like a perfect example for that. <laughs> what? Well, her name is Donna Louise. Oh yeah. She uses her logo yes. as a profile picture, not a face. Yeah. And her basically like the handle is for the love of puzzles. <laughs> so when that happens, we get to meet people, and they're like, "Oh yeah, we spoke on Instagram," and I'm like. Um, who are you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so it's like they give us their name, but obviously there is no profile picture, nothing. And then it took us like a few days to figure out who everyone was because when they start posting pictures from, yes, from yes. like making the puzzles, like holding the puzzle up, and it's like, oh, yes, there's their Instagram. And we're yeah. like, okay. So, like, that, that can be a bit yes. confusing, I think. Yeah. Like, right, yeah. So I had to write everyone down. I kept yeah. saying to Jeanette, I'm an old lady, Jeanette. I can't remember how. <laughs> but no, it was but amazing yeah. how many we met. Are you surprised at how many people we met? Yeah. Like I'm surprised with how open, like yeah. welcoming everyone welcoming. is. Yeah. Friendly. Like I did not expect that at all. Yeah. Like I think I've made more friends in four days than I did in the past ten years. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. It's like I don't want to leave. Like we get each other. Yeah, you know, we both we have like this... these puzzle nerds. Yeah, puzzle and nerds. It's just like we oh. all get each other. Oh, it's, it was lots of fun. It yeah. was so much fun. So, what would you say about the competition? Like, uh, yeah, similar like what you asked me. So, is there something that like was exactly what you expected it to be, or something that was like maybe you were dis not disappointed, but like didn't meet your expectations, yeah, or, or like exceeded your expectations? Well. I had watched all the live streams last year, so I kind of had an idea of everything. So I knew about the cameras mm -hmm. coming right up in your face and everything. Yeah. And so that really didn't bother me because I guess I'm comfortable on camera anyway. No. Yeah. Kind of. You kind of have to be. You kind of have to be. <laughs> I'm trying to think. Um, I didn't expect it so many people. Yeah. And there are a lot well, of people. Well, it did double this year. It didn't doubled. It? I yeah. Think from last year. Yeah. yeah. I didn't expect how much pressure I would put on myself to perform mm -hmm. and that's just me like well you were not the only oh one. yeah everyone I, everyone did it but yeah. I didn't th I didn't realize how much pre how much the like the of the competition mm -hmm. would you know I need to work on that 
And I felt like once I said, calm down, relax. And then I, I almost told myself, look, you know you're not going to win. Mm -hmm. Just puzzle and have fun. I had to tell myself that just to relax. Yeah. I didn't realize how much I would get so like nervous. Yeah. But it did, it did fade over the days. Yeah. But you puzzled with your headphones on. I did. I did. Yeah. Puzzled with my headphones on the entire time. I, I'm not sure if that made me puzzle slower or faster. Like I don't but it made you enjoy more. Yes. It made me <laughs> calm down and made me enjoy it more. Yeah. Oh, and we were a team. So I've been listening to the same music for the last few months. It's Imagine Dragons live in Las Vegas. Okay. And that's yeah. what I had on my headphones. And Vicky likes their music. So during the teams when we were doing Orange Hell, that. Orange oh Hell, God. that's all we're going to say about that puzzle, we picked wrong. <laughs> okay. No. And I said, I started to sing to calm myself down. And she okay. started singing with me. But lo, we weren't bothering no. the other puzzlers. And you two were just, you and Juby were just listening. And we sang like a verse of the song. And oh my God, that, that just, I was like, ah. Well, that was one thing. And that was the one song that really, well... <laughs> We had a few songs. Which that was the what the Bob's Burger. Oh, the Bo I also I love the Bob's Burger movie. So we are gonna watch it tonight, just yeah, so we yeah, know, because yeah. I've never seen it. I don't know what the series oh, is. So. It's hilarious. It's hilarious, yeah. and it's like the first movie. I can't sing, and I won't sing it because I'll probably get a copyright. But it's like the every day we come downstairs and lock the doors and turn the signs to open. Anyway, that song, if you know what it is, <laughs> and it just has a good beat because yeah. you're just like yeah. And but then, that was another two. Was, was, <laughs> I don't even remember how we got to this because we were going to do pairs. So Jeanette and I did pairs together. Yeah. Juby and Vicky did pairs. And we decided that if you were freaking out, I would sing to you. Yeah, because I, for me, it's like I can get into my head. Mm. And if I at some point decide I'm not going to be able to finish the puzzle, I just get really stressed out and don't know how to puzzle anymore. Yeah. And I said, if that happens, I'm going to just ask you. <clears throat> To sing to me. <laughs> What's the title we want? Like, it's, it's called Soft, Soft Kitty. Kitty from the Big Bang Theory. <laughs> and I literally started like stroking your arms to calm you down. And I started singing it. And then the cameras the were cam there. I think the cameras were right there. I don't know if they caught it or not. But I took the time to sing the whole verse. You know, I'm sure people were like, what is she doing? Why isn't she puzzling? But did it help? It did. Yeah. It just, I, yeah it's you need to find a mechanism to to refocus and to mm -hmm. calm down. I think that's really important. Yeah. Like find your happy place. Yes, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and I will admit I didn't expect that first puzzle for the first round to be so hard. Yeah. And that you you did get a Yeah, a that one. deflated me. I'll talk more about that in my recap video. But then I was really proud at how well we did in pairs. Yeah. The, no, the the preliminary pairs. I was yeah. really proud of that. And I'm really proud of our team's results. And we'll talk more about that specifically because we actually found out, like, in the team's results, we found out how well we did on each puzzle and yeah. the, the ranking for each specific puzzle. And we did well. <laughs> we, yeah, I'm really, I'm really proud of that. I'm yeah, really me proud too. of that. So I just, I would hope for next year that I could be, like, better prepared for the stress I put on myself, yeah. which is unnecessary, how to calm down. And now it's almost going to be more exciting because I'm just going to be, I can't wait, all these people and all these friends. Like, they're friends. We, we have yeah. so many new friends. Puzzle friends. Puzzle friends. And I'm just hoping that they're going to be there next year. Oh, yeah. Because it's like, it will be so nice to see. I mean, I think the majority of them are going to be there unless something drastic mm. happens. Yeah. So would you say that the trip was worth it? Oh. Like, you... We have to point that out, guys. <laughs> we had like the Guinness World Record thing happening in the background. And <laughs> Donna Louise actually asked the guy because <laughs> she traveled the farthest, furthest. What is it? Farthest, furthest. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. To so, get to the competition. To get to the competition. So she was like, can I get into the Guinness World Records? No. Yeah, if yeah. she can get the record for it. So she said... It's fun, but unfortunately not. No. He was, he mostly, I said, can I get into the Guinness Book of World Records for the person who has traveled the farthest to get to a speed puzzling competition? He goes, oh, that's a fun idea, but no. no. <laughs> <laughs> so we tried. <laughs> we tried. Because they did, yeah, they did at the back. They did um, the 2000 piece. piece Guinness World Record jigsaw puzzle. And it was eight people. And because there was no, like, there was no record already set. He said, look, I'll give them up to two hours. 
And if they finish it in two hours, then I'll make a record. Yeah. So, and they finished it, and I don't even know one at this time. One twenty, I think it was less than a half, yeah. one and a half. Eight people on a two thousand mm-hmm. piece, but it's a very busy puzzle. And then the other Guinness World Record that was set, which we were a part, so. part of, we're part of that. <laughs> so they're considering it the largest, like the most attendees for a jigsaw puzzle, puzzle championship. Cha- yes, yeah, speed the- puzzling competition. And that means like other competitions can apply eventually and say, well, we had more participants or, or yeah. whatever. But for the now. first one for yeah. now, we are actually part of the Guinness World Record. Can you believe Ooh. that? <laughs> yes. <laughs> us, so cool. and, us and 500 other people or. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 I think in the end, like if you look at the registration, some people ended up not competing or couldn't yeah. make it. So if you look at the results, it was a total of 539 people. That competed in like all those preliminary rounds. And um, I know some people had to leave early. And what was it for pairs? I have it written down. And and I'll talk about that more during the recap. Maybe 340 pairs? Well, it's a bit different because we don't actually know how many people were there. Because some people yeah. didn't compete individuals. Yeah, that's true. Some people didn't compete pairs. So it's like a bit... That's true. And there was a lot of husbands. Husbands, that's a We term. have to <laughs> mention that. So the. it's puzzle husbands. Well, it can be partner it doesn't have to be married like yeah you know yeah, you don't we have to it. be married but it's basically we had a lot of husbands there husbands and like pit crew oh we yeah had. someone had it someone had their name on the back of the shirt and the other person had the name and said pit crew like it was amazing oh seeing all the t-shirts the shirts and the outfits and just everyone having so much fun yeah it like, was amazing oh and people cheering and being so happy when you finished oh yeah that was people like waited for us people to waited. come out to be like, oh my god, well done. Yeah. Obviously, that means that they finished <laughs> yes. in the majority. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I liked puzzling in the back row. Yeah. Yeah. It was actually quite yeah, fun. I was I I was quite comfortable back there. And also one thing that surprised me was I thought it's gonna stress me out to puzzle next to someone. Yeah. Because the tables didn't look that big. No. But really, it it actually calmed me down because I was like, oh, I'm not alone in that. <laughs> uh, I know. I got lucky for the individual finals. I puzzled oh next to Siobhan. who came to the puzzle night. Right. Yeah. So she's lovely. Lovely. Yeah. lovely. And then for the what was the other one? Oh, the individual preliminary. I puzz- shared a table with a gentleman. And what was funny is normally they put the chairs both on the same side. Oh, yeah, you said that. But yeah. he took his chair and put it on the other side so we wouldn't be next to one another. And I thought, oh, that's going to be weird because I'll be looking at him. It wasn't at all. Like, he had his puzzle, I had my puzzle. I think and it was just, good. like, block everything yeah, out. Yeah, that did not bother I, I agree. That didn't bother me at all. That didn't phase me one bit puzzling next to someone. Yeah. No, that's yeah. That's good. Like, yeah. it didn't bother me either. So. Yeah. Because the... The individual preliminary round, I was third table in the front row. (laughs) Okay, let's just a minute. Okay. Thank you, Alfonso. He's the the main organizer of the whole event for believing in me (laughs) that I was of a merit to be at the third table in the front row. I really appreciate that. But then for the qualified to the semifinals, I was back row. I think like you are quick. I think it was just the stress of like yeah. not expecting what's what to expect, yeah. so not knowing what to yeah. expect. Because, for example, we got here to Madrid last night, and mm-hmm. we went downstairs and we said, "Let's just puzzle." And we took what's the name of? We have no idea what the names of all the puzzles are. It's the Paris one with the Eiffel Tower. Vicky had it. Was it. A group E. Vicky had it in yeah. her individual preliminaries. Group e. Yeah, and we thought, let's just puzzle it. We, we didn't speed puzzle it. We knocked we that out. We took our time. We were literally like half puzzling in the left because we were waiting mm-hmm. for the waitress to clean the table. Yeah. So like doing selection of like the edge, yeah. sorting a little bit. Oh my God. It, I, I did I think whole, we did it in like what, 50 minutes? Maybe 50 minutes. Yeah. And I did, oh, there might be some sirens in the background. <laughs> and I did like the whole solid color sky and there was a bit of blue. And I literally, it was as if, I don't know, Jenna, I just went, Oh, yeah, that piece, that piece. And I looked at her and went, where was this Donna Louise at the competition? It was the caffeine. Oh, yeah, maybe. <laughs> oh. Yeah, we asked for decaffeinated ice lattes. There had to be caffeine in that because we stayed up till quarter after three yeah. last night. So this, last is night. A, this is this is us after like 
six hours of sleep. Five, well, <laughs> well, you woke up early. Yeah, you I just put my sleeping mask on. I'm like, yeah. no one bothered me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, goodness. I was so comfortable. Yeah. And I'm like, I know I can puzzle fast. I know I can be faster than what I was. So I want to work on, or for the next year, what I need to do to try to calm myself, focus myself. And enjoy more. And yeah, try to yeah. enjoy the experience more because I, I did it to myself. Overall, I loved it though. I, I loved know. it. I loved it. Absolutely, hands down. But I need to work on that. Yeah. Yeah, more from, and I'm sure even like like sports athletes have to deal with with that. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's performance anxiety. Yeah, performance yes. anxiety. Ex- because last night I went, I just completed that whole white sky in no in, time. In no time at all. And I went, what the monkey butts? Like, I know I can do this. What happened? So I do feel I underperformed at the competition, mm-hmm. but I'm not disappointed in no, no you way. Shouldn't be. And no one should be disappointed at all with anything. No. Oh, one thing I loved, and I think you'll yeah. agree, we forgot, we didn't mention this in your video commentating we got oh, to wow. commentate <laughs> yeah we did yeah on the video on the live streams that was such an honor that was so much fun mm-hmm. that was so nice that was really cool so he made us commentate like just after we finished yes. the individual puzzle because he wanted to know like talk our about experience the experience and, and everything yeah yeah and it was actually after going through the nerve-wracking experience of like putting the puzzle together for the first time, just sitting down and talking yes. about it, it was so much better. I was like, maybe I should just stay yeah. till the end of the event, just commentating, not puzzle yeah. anymore. Yeah, yeah, I did feel like I did much better at commentating than I did at puzzling, but that first puzzle. But, yeah, but I think it was just literally like not knowing what to expect yeah yeah and i think we just put like too much pressure we on did us. we did because i felt i might disappoint someone yeah. like disappoint you in pairs or no. disappoint the teams or or coming back and doing the recap video yeah. and disappointing and be like well i didn't qualify or something like yeah. that it's like it it comes but, with a bit of pressure yeah but no one ever said that they would be disappointed like it, no. it was all and we had so many nice comments from all oh, of you guys. It's the, like thank you, thank you. We yeah. saw thank you so much for those live stream comments. And I mean, I cannot express like my heart is full. Like really, yeah, yeah. Well, now it's gonna get empty for the next year oh, no, no, no. until it gets full again. Yeah. Oh, pain's gonna hurt. Oh, <laughs> oh, Jeanette, seriously, thank you so much for coming with me and for trusting to come and. Share a hotel room with someone you... Room, you yeah, mean bed. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Share a hotel bed with someone you, you know, only have been chatting with online for last year. It was so great meeting Juby and Vicky. And you're coming with me next year, right? Like, I am going to do everything I can to be here next year. Well, I'm coming even if you don't come. Oh, so. I've got so many friends now. Yeah. I, oh, <laughs> you don't need me anymore. I do. Yes, you Who's going to share a bed with me? Come yes. on. <laughs> oh, my God. And seriously, we're going to do so many recap videos yeah. and follow-up videos. This is just a fun little kind of vlog. Yeah. And if you're thinking of going, honestly, honestly, just go. it doesn't matter how fast or slow you puzzle go if you can afford it if you can make it you will not regret coming and Mm -hmm. we want to meet you we want to meet everyone yeah so 2024 yeah 2024 yay i'm up for it oh i forgot i gotta do my outro oh gosh (laughs) thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it the love of puzzles i hope you enjoy my videos please consider subscribing until next time Ciao. ciao You think that was good? Yeah. Yay! I think so, hopefully. <laughs>